On September 11th, our nation was reminded of the need for vigilance in our homeland security. We were reminded of the need that our dedicated fire rescue and patrol officers have for state-of-the-art equipment to help them save lives. One of the steps that our government agencies are taking to protect our vital maritime infrastructure is the use of mission-critical, purpose-built equipment that helps them get the job done. In short, they are using extreme fire and rescue craft. For tactical water purposes for the SWAT team, it's very safe because we can put people off the stern of the boat without worrying about props. We can go in shallow water. It does about what I guess to be about 55 to 60, 60 miles an hour with the power that we had in this boat. Um, and that was with all six people on board. We got it very quick, maneuverable boat. Uh, practical for our applications, yet user friendly. Uh, anyone can pretty much drive the boat for a uh, SWAT operation. We think it'd be a great tool. Extreme fire and rescue boats already in use are getting international and domestic praise and recognition for the powerful rescue and patrol tool they have become. The world may have changed, but at Extreme Fire and Rescue, we are ready for the future with purpose-built mission-critical boats that help to protect and save lives.